Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Kwelumi and I'm back with another video. In this video, I am going to be teaching you guys how to make a mask without sewing. So you don't need to sew the mask, you just make it. It's no sew mask. Yeah. So you're going to make use of a sock. You're going to be using a sock, but if you don't want to tear up your sock, you can use a fabric you are no longer using, a scrap fabric. So and you're going to need a pair of scissors. To my returning subscribers, thank you very much. And if you're new here, don't forget to press the like button and don't forget to subscribe. Turn on the bell next to the subscribe button to get notified anytime I post. And let's get right into the video. So the process is so I just got a pair of socks I no longer use. And okay, so let me show you guys using the scrap material. Well, I don't have the exact inches it has to be because I watched the video online and I was like, oh, so I can make it max like this. So I don't need this one. It's too small. I'm just cutting that because I don't need it. And then we can use this one. So yeah, I'm just going to get this piece of fabric and cut out the edges to make it smooth. Cut out the rough edges to make it smooth. This is a DIY, so you can do it yourself. Yeah, it's not hard. When I first did it, I was like, eh? Hey. So fun to make, like, what? So I just cut out the rough edges. Now, what you're going to do is fold this in half, like this. See? You see that? Wait, let me show you again. This is it, it's full. Fold it in half, smoothing it out so it's like this now folded in half. You are going to cut on the fold. This is the folded part, right? Not this open place, you cut on the fold. Not this place, you will cut on where, on the fold. Yeah, this is what you call the fold. So the closed part is what you cut, not this open part. So you take your scissors, you cut right through it not cut all the way you have to stop i think this is actually big because the size is like so big let me see it on my face um. you will cut here and you don't cut all the way stop before you before you cut all the way just stop you're not cutting all the way so you will cut from here stop right there do the same thing on the other side of the fold cut from here go all the way down and stop before you reach the end you are not going all the way because that will form the handles of the mask so take your scissors on the fold remember remember not this open place on the fold look at this on the fold scissors so. cut it right through it stop right there do not go all the way so now this is what you have for this side so now this forms the handle so you're going to do that to the next side let's fold it back I'll show you guys the end product. So now you're done. Do the same thing to the other side. Cut and stop. Not all the way. Now you have a mask. You have a mask. <laughs> let me show you guys. So let me write it now. It's a little big, but yeah, because I didn't get the right exact amount, but you know what I mean? This is the mask. You have the handles and you have the handles, so yeah. Yeah, mine is too big, so it depends on the size you want. This is a small one, so yeah, let's try to make another one using this smaller, smaller show you guys how it looks like. This one is too big, so like my mom and dad can wear this one. But this is the result, the mask. As easy as that, look. So now let's make using the smaller piece. So this is a small piece. Do the same thing. Fold and you cut. You fold in half, cut on the fold. And do not go all the way. Let me straighten this out. I don't need all this piece. Just trying to make it straight. That's, we get the same, get equal. So now you cut on the fold. You cut on the fold. Do not go all the way down, stop. 
You see, I cut but I didn't finish. I just left it there. Do the same thing to the other side and cut. Leave it there. And now, let's try it. Look at how it looks. This one is smaller. A baby can wait. No, it's too big for a baby. But like a seven, six year old can wear this. But let me show you guys. This one is so extremely small. It can't even fit because it's so small. If it doesn't fit, you can always take it. Let's try again. This one is so small. Like, it's not for me. But as you can see, this is the result. Yeah, it's because it's small. But if a smaller person than me wore it, it's going to look good on them. But yes. I made a really big one, a really big mask. And I made a really small one. So, yeah, you just have to decide on who you are making it for. And then you can do different sizes of mask. Now, let's go over with the sock. I'm sure people want to try the socks. You will cut out this this edge and the mouth. You cut out both edges of the sock. You guys should be able to see this now because the lighting is giving me a problem. Like what? So yeah, you cut out the edge, both edges of the sock. Look. Cut it out the down part and the top part of it so yeah this is what i have after cutting out the top parts of it you're going to do the same thing for this elastic part this elastic part has to watch go. me take this cutting it out so now you don't have either side both sides are open now Get the clean socks my socks is cleaned by the way my sock is clean so ah. yeah so both sides are open the next step is you want to cut one of this this longer parts any side you can cut it open so we're going to cut it open so you see this long parts you're going to cut, cut it straight see i'm going through the long edge you can do any side it doesn't matter now the sock is opened I apologize for the dark quality. My sock is white, so anytime I try to on the lights, the ring light, it's you guys can't see what I'm doing. So I have to like really come close to the camera for you guys to see. You cut out all edges of the sock. What you do now is fold the sock in half. So this is the sock. I hope you guys can see. You fold it in half. And you just basically do the same thing like you did with the cloth. So I just folded it in half now. So the sock is folded in half. And then you cut on the fold. Cut straight down, not to the end. On the fold. Do not cut all the way down. So you cut. Stop. So this is what we have now. Yeah, so it's just like the other one. You cut the second fold not all the way down just go and stop and you have a mask now let me wear it for you guys the quality changed because i turned off the lights oh this is like perfect oh my gosh look at this you have learned how to make a mask using a piece of fabric and a sock That wasn't hard if you don't get if you don't get something you can always pause the video and like it's just the same thing fold the material in half cut on the fold do not go all the way down stop half for the sock you cut out both edges <laughs> of the sock and then you cut straight through the longer side of the sock when you cut open the socks it's going to be like this and then you continue from what I did. You fold it in half, cut on the fold. It's simple, guys. It's very, very, very simple. How do I look? Yeah, you don't have to buy a mask. You can make it in your, in your own. You can make it in your own home. Yeah. 
super easy easy peasy i made the larger size i can't even wear it and i made the smaller size it's too tight so, yeah depends on the size you want to make but that's it that's the end guys thank you for staying tuned go and make your own at home and that's the end of the video thanks for watching for me it's a see you again peace and love for me to you and love for me to you hey. see you in my next video